Okay. For uh, what we gonna what we gonna uh, do? What I ask you to do in the exam. So be as follow. First, product design. The product design. First time we met, we talked about this operation management. This about the uh, first we start from the marketing approach, and we would like to uh, decide the product that we can sell. So the first handouts is a uh, forty pages. This is product design. The key of product design is to understand the customers and design the product according to the customer. This is seems like uh, the marketing stuff or uh, product design way and the market research. So if you remember that, I asked, I have asked you to design the the product, the the wallet, a wallet for the customer group, for the customer group. I asked you to design and sketch. But uh, a little bit different of uh, product design in the product design in uh, production management is a product characteristic. This is engineering characteristic. So we can do many things, but the limitation is that what we call uh, uh, like a engineering characteristic, for example, like if you like to design a, a camera. So this, the camera must be uh, lightweight, reliable, easy to hold steadily, no doubt, approaches. This is what customer want. This is what customer want. But we want to ask ourselves that can we do this? Can we do this or not? We have to analyze the the engineering characteristic as a show in the show in the on screen. So I have a correction of a, the point that this is. For example, to make the a camera light, lightweight. So we need aluminum components or um easy to use. We need autofocus, auto exposure screen. Uh, frame advance and economic design. That if this engineering characteristic satisfy this function that customer use, this is what we accept. What we're gonna accept to use this uh, characteristic for our products. So this is the key. In the final exam, I will not ask you to draw a house of the quality exactly the way industrial engineering do. But I would like to ask you to sketch up and uh, and uh, design like uh, this is an example of uh, ah so there's some uh, okay ten this uh, come attention okay good morning ten can you good morning sir yes yes okay okay um I I just start I just start. Uh, first of all, I would like to uh, ask you to check the exam schedule because the registration system, it says the final exam schedule is on um, May 7, May 7, and uh, May 7, uh, but you have to recheck the, the registration system first. What I... Uh, what I am now uh, doing is uh, tell you what the, the final exam is. The first question will be the product design. This is example what you have done in this uh, in the first assignment. This the then then the I will not ask you to draw um house of quality. The first question is that I would like to ask you to draw one product i cannot tell you what it is but i would like to ask you to sketch the product and tell the um, engineering characteristic for example if you decide camera lightweight we need aluminum parts easy to use we need autofocus but if you design this one yourself okay we need photo you have to tell 
yeah, like I uh, mentioned before, you have to tell engineering approach, engineering characteristic for for the product. Uh, what is the raw material? How can this made of? So this is the first question. But uh, <clears throat> the group, I I will tell you group of uh, customer, it's like of the customers that um, I cannot tell you the, what customer they are and what the product looks like. But uh, this is the first question to, to, for you to design, right? Bicycle, bags, cameras, or whatever. Okay. So then this is the first question I'm going to tell you. If you, uh, if you have any uh, question, uh, you can ask. There, there are five questions, you know, final exam. So this will be on site uh, according to the university schedule. First is product design. It's product design. It's product design. I will give you customers and the product. I ask you to sketch. There are five questions. Five questions. Of course, you can bring any kind of material, the handouts, uh, anything in the exam. No, not open in open book. Open open book exam. Open book exam. You can you can bring anything. Anything. Okay. First question, 20 points. Okay. The second question. Uh okay, I I have recorded this uh I have recorded this this video clips and uh I will I will send to you again as as usual. Okay, the second question is the second handouts. The process, process, service, and design. So remember the way of the production work is to, to write the everything systematically. That means we need the flow chart. Flow chart, a flow chart, for example, wake up. So we have a process of wake up. We make coffee. We have must have process of coffee, like you did in your assignment. So this is the concept of a working procedures that we use in ISO document concept. I, I will not ask you about ISO, what it is, and what are the, uh, the, the uh, criteria for the ISO, whatever. But I would like to ask you to the second question, to write the process of making a product. So your your assignment is a uh, is a cup noodles is a cup noodles. So I would like to ask you something very similar, like a simple food or something, like a simple food or something. The key is how to write a good flow chart. First, according to this one, for example, I will recap you about this one. We have to start with something. Okay, I feel thirsty. I feel hungry. And I would like to make a cup of coffee. First, I have to do something first. Okay, first I have to prepare the water. But the key, not says only uh, I would like to prepare the water and how. How can I prepare the water? Of course, we need 90 degrees, 940 degree temperatures, boiling for uh, two minutes, boiling or whatever. You have to need the, to write the, the regulation to control the standard of your work. This is very basic of the operation. Prepare cup. What kind of cup? Of course, not the temperature. Maybe cup with cup beer or long cup, short cup, or whatever. You need to write the, the we call work instruction. Work instruction and and variable and variables to control the quality of the step. Prepare the coffee. How to prepare the coffee? Maybe 
30 grams of the coffee. Yeah. Then if you have some process that need decision, decision is that milk, you need milk or you, okay, you can have to have milk. This is the diamond. We need the choice. Add milk. Okay. You need to work in section. Add sugar. How can we add sugar? And stir. And how can stir? 10 times stirring. 10 times stirring. So the second question is that process design. Process design. For a simple product. I cannot say yet what kind of product will be. 20 points for the process design. Write a flow shot, like a flow shot. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then the third question. The third question is operation tools. Operational tools. If you remember that um, the, the third handouts that will be uh, the operational tools. So the on screen, uh, this is the third one. Operational tools, we start off, uh, this is uh, many tools available. PDCA, Toyota Production System 5S, Ishikawa Diagram 5Y, Poka Yoke, Andong Visual Control Kaizen Milk Grant. Okay, I forget the milk. No, no. I, I, I not focus on something very difficult like milk run or DOE. But only one of tools will be in the exam. But I cannot, cannot tell you what it is. So this is the third question is the random question. I would like to ask you to explain what it is, the concept it used. For example, PDCA, the concept, the concept, application, example, okay. So what is PDCA? This is a descriptive. Okay, first one, PDCA. Productivity is not include. Toyota system may, may for example, I may ask them, um, what is Muri? Can you explain? And the right answer is the answer with an example. With an example, you know. Yeah. What is Muda? What is Mura? So what are they? What are they? Or 5S. Can you give um explanation of 5S or uh, Ichikawa diagram? So how many? So for the operational tools, maybe, maybe PD, CA, maybe Muda, Mura, Muri, or uh, Ishikawa, or Poka Yoke, or and Andong. So anything else? Five S, maybe five S or uh, Kaizen. Uh, maybe five S or Kai Kaizen. So there are a lot. I give you uh one. Only one tools, one two, but maybe among of this. Maybe among of this. Yeah. O only one uh, specific. So that means I, I will not ask you to select. No selection. Maybe one question, maybe PDCA. 
Um, I think uh, the way to do this uh, to do this question is that you prepare for all for all of them. I think this is uh, because it is open book exam. Maybe you you prepare all of these uh, these uh, tools, and if a question comes, you can select twenty points. Only one, two, one, two, only. No selection. Okay. Next one. Next one is uh, inventory control. Inventory control is a calculation question. So uh, for for Tian, uh, you 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 uh, you did the. Uh, uh, the, the example already, but the, for Natapat, I would like to ask you to see the video clips. So I asked you, I, I, I showed you, I have shown you the calculation. What is ordering cost? What is the setup cost, inventory model, and inventory usage over time? The question will be direct, very direct. That means I will give you a uh, the demand per year. Okay, if you control control inventory for one business for trading business, uh, I will give you demand per year for demand per year maybe uh pieces per year demand and S means set up or ordering cost per time uh of uh, you order and give you a shelf cost carrying cost that you invent uh the products in the warehouse. And what I ask you to do is a one-time ordering. This is optimum order of the quantity. What is we ask? And ask following as a, as a formula. That is a expected number of order, how many times per year? There must be per year. And I will give you expected time between orders and ROP. I will ask you to follow the 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 calculation and of course the inventory cost to calculate the inventory cost inventory cost for uh for one product only so the cost if you have a one order of the quantity that you have to uh you can see this uh to see this one, we need the minimum total cost. First, that means you need the total cost. That means uh, uh, you need for uh, first carrying cost, yeah, or setup cost, carrying cost, plus uh, ordering of uh, ordering cost, of ordering cost. Yeah. And what is this? So we check the example. And uh, the question will not be uh, different from the example, but you have to change. I, I have to change the, the numbers. So this is in your hand. If you have a, uh, you work and uh, you can do the calculation. Calculation, that is 20 points. 20 points calculation. Okay. There's uh, four. The next one is uh, last week. I I uh, give you a clip. This is a uh, like um uh not um calculation. This is a uh, human resource and productivity. So the way we uh the way we make people subordinate to work more we need to increase their incentive or or else not only money money is is it money is incentive of course but not everything how to make people work more and more i talk about the concept of the productivity that means the concept maybe comes in the question the productivity concept what is productivity what 
is productivity and how can we improve the productivity the concept is to uh, reduce the supportive time and increase the productive time and maintain the non productive time uh, this is okay the according to the handouts the techniques that can uh, improve the productivity is a job specialization and uh, uh, make people work only one thing for a long time and the speed is up the speed is up mean time decrease time decrease mean you pay lower cost or if uh, he or she boring with the same job for a long time you need a job enlargement or job enrichment for uh, to increase the motivation so i would like to emphasize on this job enrichment job enrichment what what are they and how can the we 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 give in the in the work uh workplace job rotation empowerment and I will emphasize on this theory, no, uh, no Maslow. So the Herzberg theory. The Herzberg theory is that uh, the very practical theory. So to ask people to work more, to work more, we give the motivator. But if uh, we would like to maintain. The, we can say maintain the performance to average. We just give a very uh, simple hygiene factor, policy, supervision, working condition. So mainly if you see that, if uh, I would like to increase productivity more than average, we can give job satisfier or motivator more than hygiene factors. So uh, I gave the example, uh, gave some example in the last video clips. So, the last one, question number five, what is going to be is uh, how can we improve the productivity? Productivity improvement for a, a specific job. What kind of job? I will give you uh, one, one, uh, one uh, example, but I cannot tell you at this point what kind of jobs i don't know so there are one two three four five five question 100 points 100 points for the final exam so for the so for uh grading so the final exam is the main i think uh Discard this small class, so I will uh, give you according to the your your homework, no problem. So, but if you do well in final exam, your grade will be good. So it's not kind of a serious grading. Yeah, I will capture this one and send to the to the line group. Thank uh, you, sir. Yeah. Okay. And. Uh, any questions so far, uh, Tian and Natapat, for, for the final exam? Uh, so for the project, uh, project improvement, right? We don't need any calculation, right? We just need, uh, how to say, theory, and we will, we will have to write, right, sir? Yeah, yeah. No calculation, no calculation. Maybe I ask you uh, to improve the... Uh, Productivity of um like a, a truck driver, maybe okay. We just give example for uh one or two example. Yeah, description, no calculation. Okay, so so there will be only one calculation in the exam. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, okay, sir. So. Uh so so for the process designs uh sample chart, right? Uh is that the one that I do? Uh, how to say? Is that the same with the assignment that I do? Mm. Like uh, I mean, like like that charge only, right? Not like a big chart. The chart. Uh, what 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 kind of a chart? Yeah. Uh, the noodle one, sir. The middle one.
uh, uh, I, I, I not understand uh, what, what you mean, the point of, again, please. Uh. Uh, yeah, so uh, in the example, sir, uh, so there are, how to say, two charts, right? The one with the, how to say, the one, the simple one and the not very simple one, right? But uh, I only do the, how to say, uh, simple one in the assignment. So I, I, I want to know if it is like the same for the final exam. Yeah, yeah, it would be the same. Only simple chart. Simple. Uh, chart. Yeah. Okay, sir. Thank you. Okay. So to uh only simple this this enough. Uh, if you understand, yeah, you you can write it simply. Uh, Mister Natapa, do you have any question? Okay. 